Just with the clocks changing, we're going to let a lot of questions probably this week as to how you change the clock on a Honda. So the clock display, this is like any of the Hondas with this Honda Connect system here. The clock is displayed over there, but it's also displayed on the radio as well. Anyway, the first thing you want to do is find your, depending on way your menu set out, you're going to look for something called settings. And it's actually pretty easy on these. So you're going to find something over here called clock. Very obvious. I know a lot of people will kind of say, how do people get stuck with this? But we still get this question a lot when the times change. So um, you've got a clock type. So, you know, do you want a small digital clock? Do you want an analog clock? You know, whatever it is on the screensaver, fine. But crucially, anyway, the reason you're here for this video is how to change the time. Now, one thing I'd say is a lot of these cars uh, will have a setting called auto time zone or auto daylight. So you want to make sure that that's checked as on. Sorry, the screensaver, this is our own car at home. So this is the one that Mammy drives. Anyway, um, so the... If they're checked on, really the time change in Ireland last night and the time is proper when I got into the car this morning. However, if you didn't have that set, you would go into clock adjustment. Seems pretty obvious, but, uh, and then you'd dab upwards or dab downwards, depending on what you want. And that's it. So like I said, if you haven't got these checked on, so say I didn't have auto daylight checked on. So turn that off. Now the clock's gone back to 10 o'clock where it was before. Um, so I had this car checked on which means it automatically updated uh, when the clocks changed last night. But anyway, if it doesn't, you just go into clock adjustment and that's it. Unless for some reason you're set, there is different ways you can set out these menus. So say for example, the clock didn't come up straight away. You go back into settings. Instead of using the clock up here, you can also do it through system. So if you don't have the clock tab, just go into system and then scroll down through, 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 and you will eventually get to clock type, clock adjustment, auto time zone. So the exact same stuff that we saw already, but I just going into system uh, instead of going into settings. So there's two ways to do it, depending what way your car is laid out. Anyway, hopefully that video is useful. Thanks for watching.